Volko, Wilson, Rus, Portolano, Barnes, Kilty, Sipos, and Paulina. That's the first two to go through by right. And on the inside, the Slovak. Um, 2016 Slovakian champion, incidentally, 10.42 he qualified with, he's 10.33 on the season. Alex Wilson of Switzerland, transfer, transferee from Jamaica, semi-finalist uh, in the European Championships uh, four years ago. Well, Julian Roos is one of the men that can go close to 10 seconds, the German record holder at 60 and 100 metres, and uh, German champion for the fourth time. Ortilano of uh, Spain, the Spanish record holder at 100 and 200 metres. Reached the semi-final of the World Championships in Moscow in 2013. Here's another uh, Turkish athlete, uh, Emily Barnes, a Jamaican, former Jamaican, World Junior Championships for Jamaica. He uh, was in the same relay team as Joanne Blake. Richard Kelty, the former World Indoor Champion, won his heat, reigning European Indoor Champion as well. Reached the semi-final of the World Championships last year. Janos Sipos, three times the Hungarian indoor champion. He's got the seventh lane. And then Hensley Paulina, <laughs> enjoying the moment in front of his home crowd. Seventh in the semi-final of the World Indoor Championships in Portland this year. But just the first two to go through. Watch out for Riz, the German. He's a very, very strong competitor, Paulina. 10.23 is a personal best set this season, incidentally. Roos on paper, and Hortolano, the Spaniard, uh, has gone pretty well. These two have both set to personal best this season. And Richard Kilty, best of 10.05 as a personal best. How he would dearly enjoy getting to 10 seconds. away well, so is Hortolano, Roos and Hortolano, these two and Richard Kilty going strongly and so is uh, Barnes, and here comes Kilty and Kilty's got it! Kilty got it, a photograph for the second place, but that was a very good run, 10.15, Richard Kilty into a slight headwind, 0.4 metres per second, but my goodness me, beats uh, athletes who've gone a little bit quicker than him, but that's good for the former world indoor champion, he's got himself through to the final. Very, very good uh, performance indeed. Let's have a look and see who got the place. It was very close. Hortolano got it at 10.22. And Roos at 10.22. So the photograph just gave it to Hortolano. What that does mean, Stuart, is that the first, first four men from that first semi-final will be going through to the final. So Ramil Guliev, 10.07. Solomon Bakari, lifetime best for the Dutchman. They will go through to the final along with the first two from each of those first three races. So uh, good news all round. Yeah, it was, wasn't it? Very, very strong second half of the race from Kilty, making a lot of ground on Hortiland and Roos, and Roos would have expected to go through uh, to the final, that's for sure. On paper, he should have done, but Kilty, well, looks across even. He knows he's got it. Very determined young man. He just cannot get sub-10 at the moment. How he would love to do that, it would give him... It's just one of those landmarks that once you get past it, you can do it again. There it is, Richard Kilty, 10.15. Bruno Hortolano and 10.22 in second place. They are the two qualifiers.